In today's video, we would like to look at uh, a number of things. One of them is the standardized mortality rate, crude mortality rate, dielectric standardized mortality rate, and indirectly standardized mortality rate. We have the standard population of a country and one of its cities. We have been given the population and the deaths for the different age groups and the total. So the first thing we want to calculate the standard mortality rate. That's the first part that we would want to look at uh, in the video today. So how do we get the standard mortality rate? What we would also call the SMR. This is basically given by the observed death observed divided by expected so the question now that comes up is how do we get the expected given the information that we have what we do is we are going to get what we call age specific age specific death age specific specific death and this is comparing the city population with the standard population so in this case if i take this divide by this it tells me the ratio of those who are likely to have died if we had introduced the death of the standard population. So I want to look at what is the rate of death in the city. And then we compare that with the population of the city, the death of the country times the populations of the city will give me the expected. So the expected here basically means if we looked at the city by comparing the standard population, how many people would have died? And I'm going to copy these formulas there. And this tells me that 35 would have been expected to have died. But what was the actual death observed? There were 44. So that shows there's some difference between what we are observing and the actual number that would have expected. So this then will be given by this 44 divided by 20, uh, 35.22. So the standard mortality rate would be 1.25 and you know that if the value is higher or is higher than one then it means we are observing more deaths in the city population as compared to the standard population the second part that we want to talk about is what we we'll call the crude mortality rate for the city the crude mortality rate for the city and uh, that one will be given by the observed deaths in the city which is given by 44 divided by the population of the city so that gives us the number of the observed and increase that to number of decimal places if you wish but uh, approximately that's the value that you we'll get for that situation the third one is the crude mortality for the country crude mortality crude 
mortality rate for the country and this will be given by the observed deaths in the country divided by its population again that helps us to see what is the crude mortality rate for the country and we want to move on and look at other values that are of interest to us and one of them would be what i would refer to as the Dielectri standardized dielectri standardized mortality rate so i'll call it dielectri standardized mortality rate and this is where we need to do some computations so now when you look at the information we have been given here in the table one of the things that we are going to note is that this is based on standard population. Based on standard population. So the information we need is we need to get age specific death rate for the city. Age specific death rate for the city so that's what we're going to get and so i'll say uh, age specific death into bracket city and uh, that information is different from the information we got here age specific death for the country we said it was 10 divided by 50 5500 this one will be equals to 7 divided by 2000 and we're going to do that for all the four different age groups that we have been given and that's the information that we have so now we are going to multiply this we multiply it with reference to the standard population and we're going to get some specific value so we take 3500 that is i4 times c4 and then we sum them up and we'll end up getting a total value which is 108.25 so dielectric standardized mortality will be given by 108 divided by the population of the country and that will give us a uh, dielectric standardized mortality rate now sometimes in this case assuming that you are not given this column you are not given the information that i've highlighted in a different color then you could not compute the directly standardized mortality rate so what you do is you have to compute the indirectly standardized mortality rate but even if you are given that information you can still compute the indirectly standardized mortality rate and how would you do it you are going to use the age specific death rates for the country given here and we are going to multiply them this this set of information we are going to use this and you're going to multiply that with the city information so if I do that and then I copy this I'll end up getting a set of information and I get that 5.22 which is one here anyway and so we use that to be able to come up with in the electric standardized and the electric standardized is given by crude mortality rate given by smr we have the crude mortality rate yes and we can now get all the values so it will be equals to this 
times 44 divided by 32, 35.22. So that will give me the directly standardized mortality rate.